Hello viewers, in this video we will see how to use this type of liquid crystal display. Here we are using 16 into 2 liquid crystal display. We also need a breadboard, an Arduino board, two potentiometer with soldered header pins and some jumper cables. This type of display has 16 connection pins. The pin number starts from extreme left. The pin 1 of the LCD is the ground pin which is to be connected to ground of the Arduino board. This LCD requires 5 volt to operate. We need to connect 5 volt from Arduino board to pin 2 of the LCD. LCD pin 3 is the contrast pin. We can change the contrast by changing the voltage given to this pin. We will use a potentiometer to change the voltage of this pin. LCD pin 4 is the register select pin which is to be connected to pin 12 of the Arduino board. LCD pin 5 is the read write pin. It is to be connected to ground of the Arduino board. LCD pin 6 is the enable pin. It is to be connected to pin 11 of the Arduino board. LCD pin 7 to 14 are data pins but we have to connect only 4 pins. LCD pin 11 to pin 5 of the Arduino board. LCD pin 12 to pin 4, LCD pin 13 to pin 3, LCD pin 14 to pin 2 of the Arduino board. LCD pin 15 and 16 is backlight LED pin which is to be connected through a potentiometer to change the brightness of the display or you can give 5 volt directly. After connecting all the jumper cables, connect your Arduino board to your computer. Now let's write a small code for the display. Open your Arduino IDE. Now first include the liquid crystal library. Now initialize the library by associating LCD interface pin with the Arduino pin number it is connected to. First write number of Arduino pin which is connected to reset of the LCD. Then write number of Arduino pin which is connected to enable of the LCD. Then pin number connected to data pin 4, then 5, then 6 and then 7. Or for future reference we can define the pins as constant. Now in the setup section, set up the LCD's number of columns and rows. This type of display comes in different sizes like 16 into 4, 16 into 2. The one we are using here has 16 columns and 2 rows. Note that the numbering of the columns and rows starts from 0. Now in the loop section set the cursor to column 0, row 0. Now let's display some text like Arduino uptime. Now set the cursor to column 0 row 1. Now let's display number of seconds since reset. After that go to tools then select correct board, correct port and correct programmer and then click upload. Now we can adjust the contrast and backlight brightness of the LCD using potentiometers. In this way we can use this type of liquid crystal display. Thanks for watching.